Okay, so duck is done. Took about 20 minutes. They're relatively quick. They're not hard to do. Basically, you start on the top, on the back again, cutting, you know, cutting down the back, working your way down through around the ribs here. And that's why working with a fillet knife, you can kind of get right along that. And, and, a, and it's flexible, so it kind of works in there very nice. Cut all the way down, and I basically work myself all the way around. You come up through the breast underneath, up to the top here. One quick cut across, back down, and basically doing the same thing. Alternately, you can just come over to the other side and go that side, and do that side, and peel it off. So the duck's done. We're going to save the bones. These are the tips of the wings. We only leave the one segment of the wings. Um, and again, we're going to. The reason we bone them is we want to make sure that we have an opening to put stuffing in. So this one's going to get the andouille sausage dressing. So we've got the turkey underneath. You got the seasoning there and then the cornbread dressing. And then you put the duck on top. This is the second layer. And this is going to be filled with the andouille sausage dressing after being seasoned. And again, the same thing with the legs. Legs, I pulled out all the, all the tendons again. So all those have been removed. I want to make sure that the meat is as tender as possible, that there's no, um, you know, not things that are nice in there, let's just say. Uh, the, the duck is beautiful duck. Really, really nice. Um, the fat I always leave in there, unless it's a really fatty duck, if you get a Peking duck or something like that. Uh, but this duck is a natural uh, farm-raised. It's really quite nice. The fat level is beautiful, and I want to render all that fat out because this is going to go into um, the sweet potato eggplant gravy, which is to die for, where you need that. So we need that fat in there. This we're going to roast off along with the chicken. We're going to do the chicken next. Chicken probably takes about 15 minutes, 10 minutes to bone out. Um, that one's a quick one. Same thing. We cut off the ends of the legs because we don't need those. Um, and it's just completely boneless. You can also do this and make a roast out of it or roll it up and stuff it and just do it that way. But we're going to stuff one inside the other inside of another. So that's the way we do things. On to the next one.